The next question says, when a damped harmonic oscillator completes 100 oscillations, its amplitude reduces to one third of its initial value. What will be the change in amplitude after 200 oscillations if the damping factor is doubled? Assuming time period of each oscillation does not change. Now, we know that for the damping oscillation, A is equal to A0 E raised to minus KT where k is the damping factor. Now in the first case, we can say a becomes a0 by 3, one third a0 e raised to minus kt, where I assume t is the time taken for 100 oscillations. So therefore, e raised to minus kt becomes 1 by 3. Let's consider this as equation number 1. Now, in the second case, we can say again A is equal to A0 e raised to minus kt. But this time, k dash and t dash. They say k dash is double the k because the damping factor doubles. And t dash is 2 times the t because there are 200 oscillations. So, it's basically double the t. So now if I substitute A is equal to A0, it becomes E raised to minus 4KT. So E raised to minus 4KT, I can say it's nothing but A is equal to A0, 1 by 3 the whole raised to 4. That makes amplitude to be equal to A0 by 81. Now, they do not want us the new amplitude, they want us the change in amplitude. So I can say the delta A is nothing but A0 minus A0 by 81, which when solved, we get 80 A0 by 81. And that is the final answer.